Okay, let's look at clouds and adding volumetric clouds. As you can see, I've added uh, one volumetric cloud up here. Uh, the reason volumetric clouds are so effective is if you're actually flying th um, through them. Um, as you can see, they're not just one layer, they're actually almost three-dimensional. So how did I do this? Well, step one, I went into Entity, Render, Cloud. I dragged in Cloud. I raise it up into the sky. The next step is I went to Cloud File and change from default. Let's say, let's go to um, Cumulus Corner Lefty, press Open. The next step is go to Materials up here, open Materials menu, then open Clouds, and let's choose Base Clouds and press Apply. That's a different kind of cloud there. You can choose base clouds rain, apply that, see what that looks like. They're a bit darker, as there's a hint of rain inside them. Might look quite nice for our instant action level that we're going to make soon. And suits the atmosphere as well, the skybox. The other thing you can do is have the cloud animated. So to do this, what you do is you come down to auto move, and then with the um, speed, just add one hole into each of these places here and press reload script. And now you'll notice the cloud is moving um, from along the y axis through here. Quite a nice little effect. And it's looking from below. And that is how you make volumetric clouds.